How to fix pain pressed audio is not available in your location. If any day any of you are a Pinterest user and any day you face a problem like Pinterest audio is not available on your location and you feel frustrated, do not worry as we have got the perfect solution for this. First of all, you have to search Pinterest on your mobile device. For that, you can directly go to the Pinterest there or in the search section on your mobile device, you can search Pinterest there. After you search the Pinterest, you can see an interface like this. Now you have to tap on Pinterest for a while. After you tap on Pinterest for a while, you can see an interface like this. Now you have to go to the option of app information and tap on app information. After you tap on app information, you can see an interface like this. Now firstly, you have to go to the option of notifications and tap on notifications. After you tap on notification, you have to see an interface like this. Now you have to enable allow notification and you also need to enable allow sound and vibration. After that, you have to go back. After going back, you have to go to the next option that is the permissions and tap on permissions. After you tap on permissions, you can see an interface like this. Now you need to allow the camera, the contacts, the location, the microphone, the notification and the photos and videos. You also need to check whether there is no permission denied or not. You need to do the same as shown in the screen. After that, you have to go back again. After going back, you have to go to the next option that is set as default and tap on set as default. After you tap on set as default, you can see an interface like this. Now you need to enable the open supported links. After that, you have to go back again. After going back, you have to go to the next option that is the option of storage and tap on storage. After you tap on storage, you can see an interface like this. Now you have to check whether there is any cache or not. If there is any cache, you have to clear down the cache like this by tapping on the option clear the cache and then you need to go back again. After going back, you have to go to the next option that is app details in store and tap on app details in store. After you tap in app details in store, your very application will be opened the Google Play Store. Now you have to check whether there is any update option or not. If there is any update option there, you need to update your application. Otherwise, your very problem will be solved. Thank you for watching our video and if you really like it, do not forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you for watching our video and if you really like it,